Hello, ladies, gentlemen, future Picassos of our generation. Have I ever, or rather I should say, have you ever was wondering if there's a way that you, too, could be good at drawing? Without having to put in lots of time and effort because you're a lazy fuck. And also, you don't have to waste tons of money on a draw pad, stuff like that. Now, let's look. They say that you should look at this book by someone named Loomis. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this shit. Look at that. Look at that. You don't... What? Like, like what is this even saying? Am I supposed to read this? No. No. Fuck that, ladies and gentlemen. I am going to show you how to edit videos or make animations using only Microsoft Paint. So, uh, my mouse broke and, uh, you know, I'm too poor to get a new one. So, I'm just going to be using my trackpad to draw this here. Um, now, what you're going to need, okay, a computer, obviously a trackpad, or, you know, a mouse would be preferred. And uh, you're also going to need a, a screen recording software, like Camtasia Studio here. And it's a little over your price range, but, <laughs> you know, some of us uh, like to support our favorite devs here. And let me just close that. All right, uh, so let's move on to the actual drawing portion of the uh, the video here. Now, let's see. I'm gonna want to start. Uh, all right. Now here's the part. I want I want you to take your hands and uh, hold them in little circles around your head, like in a meditating position. Okay. Now you're gonna want to close your eyes and say. Hum, hum. Look for the inner peace within, and then draw with your heart. Just, just, just see what the, what the what the heart tells you. I'm gonna draw a circle here. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. All right. So we're gonna start it out here. This guy's name is going to be uh uh. Dan. Yeah, he's Dan. Because he's the man. Dan is always the man. He is a content individual. Who just also happens to have stick arms. So, let's just go with that. The sun is shining. It's beautiful out. Like, look at this. Look at this sun. You can draw everything with so much detail. Right. There we go. And then gonna wanna add some color to this motherfucker and yeah it's blue in the background cause you know it's like daytime out and every, everybody's uh, happy and uh, there you go and okay well here's your beginning scene now what you're gonna wanna do is save this picture mhm mm and you're gonna wanna s make a folder here specifically for it in pictures yes all right, and then I'm gonna do an Dan animation one. Yeah, and then you're gonna wanna save it in there. So then, how you're gonna make the actual animation is you keep doing the drawings, you know, frame by frame, and then what you're gonna wanna do with your you're gonna wanna open your recording software and then just open it like this right and then you can flip through the folder of drawings and as it moves you just talk over it with your screen recording software so um... you know when you make millions of views off of this animation uh... you know who to thank uh... i'll take portions of your checks and uh... yeah so i'm gonna make finish making an animation here and you can see uh... This type of animating in action. Thank you very much. This is Dan. Dan the man. Dan acts like a happy person on the outside, but on the inside, Dan is sad. 
Dan works a shitty job, has a shitty wife, and smokes shitty weed. But worst of all, Dan has a tiny dick. This tiny dick led to his severe depression. One day, but one day, Dan woke up and for no particular reason felt happy. He decided to look at life from a new perspective. He decided to not let his tiny dick get in the way of his happiness. Dan went to his amazing job, got promoted, went to his amazing wife, got laid, and smoked his dank ass weed and got blazed AF. Dan went to sleep feeling something he hasn't felt in a long time. Happy. Dan started the next day feeling better than the first. After going to work, his boss his boss approached him. Hey Dan. Yeah, I'm going to have to let you go. Why is that? Word has gotten around that you have a tiny penis. Because of this, we're going to have to let you go. Dan packed his stuff and left, feeling down, but at least he had his beautiful wife to go home to. As Dan was walking inside his home, he could hear his wife. Wanting to go surprise her with more sex, he burst open the door and was shocked to see his wife in bed with another man. How could you do this to me? I'm sorry, honey, but your tiny dick can never please me. I'm leaving you. Dan could not hold himself together any longer. He ran to his room, got his dank-ass weed, opened the bag only to find that his dealer sold him oregano. Dan took everything in his house he could to stop feeling pain, but the pain persisted. Dan decided to end it all and killed himself. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It gets me every time. Anyways. If, if you would like to make me more happy, um, please uh, donate to my PayPal, subscribe to my Patreon, go to my, <laughs> go to my MySpace, like me on MySpace, like me on Facebook, uh, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram, you know, send me money. Uh, if you have an envelope in your house, reach in your pocket. Okay, I want you to pull out all the money that you have, put it in the envelope, and then address it to Bryn. Okay, and just send it to me in the mail, and uh, yeah, so I can. Uh, you know, buy stuff for me. And uh, just make sure you subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.